Hello, welcome to VAD Inspires. And today I want to share with you a little bit about challenges and struggles. Listen, um, 220 is wrapping up and we are moving to a new year, to a new um, beginning. And for m most of you out there and, and, and most people around the world, you know, it's been a very tough time with the COVID-19 situation and uh, everybody being in a little bit of, uh, it's a, a whole civil unrest. And I'm here to remind you today that going through tough times and going through struggles and challenges, what that is a normal part of life, that is not life, right? So it's always important to remember and it's always important to think at this critical time about the things that we can do because that's what all we can focus on. When we focus on what we can do and what we can accomplish, it helps alleviate the worries. It helps alleviate the, the fears. It helps alleviate the anxiety and it helps us become better. And, and when, when, when I begin to think about improving, I can improve in a lot of things myself, you know, like posting more regularly or in terms of my fitness. Hell, I barely got back to my routine of working out every day after three months of just, you know, being lazy and not trying to do anything. And I want to raise a challenge to you. And I want us to do this together. I want us to improve together. I want us to decide that we're not going to wait for the new year to make a new year's resolution. We're going to decide today. We're going to decide that we're going to stop making the changes that that's going to propel our life to a new direction today. Because whenever you decide, that's when your new year starts. And that's the new year for you. And if you decide to make it a great year, I don't see anything or any, anyone that can stop you but you. There will be struggles, there will be challenges, but the stronger you are in trying to accomplish something, the more hard it is for situations to stop you. And it's hard to be motivated. It's hard to be persistent. It's hard to keep going when every single bone in your body is telling you to just give in. It's hard to be persistent and just say, I will not give up. That's hard to do because I've, I've, I've had my own share of worries and my own share of lackluster attitude, you know, not showing up on time, you know, not, not putting in the work, you know, being more consistent. That has been a challenge for me. And I'm sharing this with you so you will understand that you're not alone. And, I, and I'm sure everyone has their own share of challenge. But who will hear our story? Who will hear our victory if we do not persist? And that's the whole point of this. We have to persist because that's the only way that we can find out our own true self and our own true powers. And... Um, these are, these, are, these are very uh, critical times and while we are going into Christmas, you know, it might be the best of times and the worst of times as uh, one writer once wrote. And it's true. While you might be enjoying Christmas, some other people, you know, might be dealing with a loss of loved one or you might be the person de dealing with the loss of a loved one. And... Um, it's always great to remember and, and ponder within ourselves that why things might be going good or bad, depending on the situation, it's always, it's always going good or bad for someone else. And not just to make yourself feel better or to be all positive thinking kind of stuff. It's just to keep in mind and put this in perspective and not just get stuck in the and the thought that, oh, this is only happening to me. And, and that can be frustrating when we think that things are just designed to make us struggle much more than others. It's always important to put this in perspective and understand that things are also going bad for many people. And we are all struggling to get better. And we all can get better. And most importantly today, what, I'm on, uh, what I want to remind you is that look around you, 
Look around you and if everything seems bleak and dark, take a look again. You might be the light. Forgot to say, thank you and stay inspired.